And happy St. Patrick's Day to you. The 27th annual St. Patrick's Day Parade coming to Hillcrest. Why it's the largest parade west of the Mississippi coming up in a live report. NBC 739 News this weekend. Coverage you can count on. But here at home, we have a big one as well, a big St. Patrick's Day celebration just hours away. And preparations are underway this morning for the 27th annual St. Paddy's Day Parade in Hillcrest. And that's where Troy O'Hirsch <laughs> joins us with uh, more details. You've had a lot of... Uh, Irish folks out there this morning. Uh, the Irish eyes are smiling they on are. us. Top of the morning to you there, uh, Rory and Stephen. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of activity going on here as the parade's getting ready to go at about 11 o'clock. It's the largest parade on St. Patrick's Day west of the Mississippi, so it's a pretty big deal. A couple of gentlemen who are joining me now, CJ and Joseph, and they are from up the street, and you can tell that they're all uh, dressed up here in their Irish getup. Explain exactly why you're dressed like this. Uh, we're dressed to represent 16th century Irish mercenaries, northern borders of Ireland, fought for the English, the Scottish, whatever was paid. Represent, actually, 1658 is the year we're representing right now. The lineage that we wear, these are traditional fighter shirts, and then all the swords we use are one-and-a-half hand, uh, one hand broadswords. And I, I understand that you'll actually be doing a demonstration of the fighting, is that right? We'll be doing a lot of fighting all day long. <laughs> a lot of fighting all day long. Sounds like an Irish party, doesn't it? All right, gentlemen, thank you very much for coming with your swords and not swinging them at me. I also want to introduce you to some real Irish people, Angela and John Byrne, who come from where? Kilkenny. Kilkenny. And explain to us exactly why you're here. Uh, we're here uh, for St. Patrick's Day, as special, uh, special guests here. We're the dignitaries here today, myself and Angela, and we're very proud to be here today. We're very happy. You're representing, actually, Ireland here. They sent you over to represent the country for this parade specifically. Yes, actually, we're the dignitaries, and it's official by the Irish government. On Taoiseach Bertie Ahern gave us his blessing, and now we can play the national anthem here today. Only for that, it's a first for Ireland to send lay people over as dignitaries to the St. Patrick's Day Parade. And I hope everybody that is any way connected with Ireland, or Irish, or has a friend Irish, or a cousin or whatever, will come out today and celebrate with us celebrate your Irishness and uh, for St. Patrick we, we'd love you all to do that and please come to Ireland her arms are open wide <laughs> for to greet you all and meet you all there are no strangers in Ireland only friends you haven't met yet well, it sounds like you are dignitaries and officially with the Chamber of Commerce of Ireland. What, celebrate your Irishness. What a great way to put that. John and Angela, thank you very much and for also, your time. I would like to present you with a gold shamrock oh. on behalf of us here today, and you can wear it in your lapel here. Well, thank you very much. I, after some of the luck we've had here early this morning, a shamrock will be yeah. very welcome. Yeah, thank you very much. Can I just say one more thing? Well, uh, can I stop you? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I'm a television presenter back in Ireland, oh. and I'd love to work in here in San Diego. So if you need an Irish presenter, <laughs> I'm available. <laughs> thank you so much. No, no, thank you very much. Thank well, you. I'm going to celebrate my Irishness such as it is, and I, you can't take my job, though, because no, I, I no, love no, this no, job. No, 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 no. <laughs> you just want a job in, in additionally. Yeah. Would, Our, would you like me to sing a little bit of St. Saint Laurie, St. Saint Patrick? I would, except they're telling me i got to go. Oh, so, no. But we'll save that for another Happy time. Patrick's Happy St. Patrick's Day to you, too. And by the way, here's the parade route. It goes up Fifth Avenue, goes up across Upis, and then it comes back down on Sixth Avenue. Starts at 11 o'clock. Those road closures will be in effect until about 2 o'clock. So a lot of fun here at the St. Patrick's Day Parade, the 27th annual, and they've got 175 floats, a whole bunch of vendors. So come on down here to Hillcrest. And the fog is here. It's just like Ireland. Live in Hillcrest, Troy Hirsch, NBC 739. Well, Troy, so we have an Irish presenter at our disposal, and if, on a separate note, if we need any Irish mercenaries, those are available as well. So <laughs> That's right. I'm we should put that out the there, Irish. equal employment here. You know, they may take the Irish mercenaries, come and take out me, so they can be the television presenter for our next <laughs> live hit, I think. Oh, dear. I'm afraid scary. of that. Hey. All right, thanks, Troy. Good Happy job St. Patrick's Day, Troy. Happy St. Patrick's Day to you, too. Thank you. <laughs>